Good day, everyone. Jim Martin from Next Gen Appliances here. Today, we're going to cover the Untangle First Boot Wizard. In our last video, I showed you how to use the NG Series Integrated Recovery System to recover or install Untangle to your NG or XT Series Next Gen Appliance. Today, we're going to pick up right where we left off. When you first boot your appliance, you will be presented with four distinct boot options. The topmost option is default, and the system will boot this option in about three seconds. These boot options are outside the scope of this video, and for all NG and XT series next gen appliances, the default selection is optimal. When you boot Untangled for the first time, you are presented with the First Boot Wizard. Now, the First Boot Wizard is a tool that Untangled provides to help us initially set up the system. This allows us to designate network cards for assignment, assign IP addresses to our internal and external network cards, as well as set administrative passwords and other system settings. Now, Tangle is just about done loading, and we'll get started. The first screen of the boot wizard is a language selection screen. English is the default selection. Select Next to continue. And now we're presented with the Untangle Love screen. This screen informs us that the wizard will guide us through the initial steps and configuration of the Untangle server and to click Next to get started. Here's where we'll set an administrative password. Password should be complex, contain both upper and lowercase characters, as well as numbers and symbols. You also can select your time zone here, uh, and then select next to continue. This screen is where we will designate our network cards for assignment. Untangle takes the first two network cards it detects in the order and designates the first as external and the second as internal. You can drag and drop your network interfaces into the order you want or leave them as default. If you get confused as to which interfaces wish, simply plug in your interfaces one at a time and wait a few seconds. The system will detect the interface has been activated and will light up the green dot beside the activated interface. A word of advice for first time users, plug in your external or WAN interface first followed by your internal interface, and then any other interfaces you plan to use for bridge internal, bridge to external, or DMZ. Once you have your interfaces set up the way you'd like them, click Next to continue. This screen allows us to set the IP information for the external WAN interface. You can select DHCP, which is the default, static for business class WAN connections, or PPPoE for older DSL connections. Once you have set your IP, NetMask, Gateway, and DNS, you can select Test Connectivity to ensure your settings work properly. If your test fails, check your settings to be sure you entered the IP information properly. Now, once the test completes, click OK and Next to continue. This screen allows us to configure the internal or LAN interface of Untangle. If you are deploying Untangle as an edge router or firewall, you will keep the default selection, which is router, and enter the internal network address your appliance will use. The default is 192.168.2.1, but you can change this to meet your internal network requirements. Next, select the NetMask for your internal network. The default is 255.255.255.0 or slash 24. You can select any other net mask your network requires by using the dropdown box. Now, Untangle is set as a DHCP server by default. If you already have a DHCP server on your network and do not wish for Untangle to provide DHCP, simply uncheck the Enable DHCP Server box and click Next. If you are deploying Untangle as a transparent bridge, then select the Transparent Bridge Radio button at the bottom of the page. There is no additional configuration for a transparent bridge, as the external address of Untangle is the only address the system uses. Click Next to continue. Note, it does take up to a minute to save the internal network settings. 
This screen allows us to control untangle upgrades. Automatic upgrades should not be confused with automatic updates. Upgrades are just that, upgrades. Core system files and programs are upgraded to a new version. Virus definitions as well as other definition files are updates and happen automatically. The default selection is install upgrades automatically. We strongly instruct our customers to change this setting to do not install upgrades automatically. The reason for this is simple. Untangle is a core piece of your information technology. Some Untangle upgrades require automatic reboots to the appliance, which could cause an untimely interruption of internet service. We believe most network admins would like to upgrade their next-gen appliances during planned maintenance windows, where user productivity and business processes will not be interrupted, and any unforeseen problems with the new version can be handled off hours. Make your selection and click Next to continue. And we're done. We click Finish, and we are presented with the Untangle Rack. Once the first boot wizard is completed, you may be presented with the screen informing you that an upgrade is required before you can install any modules. Click the Upgrade Now button. This is the upgrade screen. It lists all the Untangle files that are to be upgraded. Click the Upgrade button at the bottom of the page. Untangle will now download upgrades and install them. This process can take up to 10 minutes. Please be patient and never power off your appliance during an upgrade. For the sake of time, we're going to pause here and let Untangle download its upgrade files. You will be presented with a pop-up that will inform you the upgrades have been downloaded and are now being applied. Click OK. This screen will show the progress of the upgrade. Once the upgrade is complete, the screen will be refreshed and you will be presented with the Untangle. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you found it to be helpful and informative. As always, thank you for your time and your business. We sincerely appreciate your support. NextGen Appliances LLC manufactures network appliances designed to run the Untangle UTM. NextGen Appliances LLC is a registered partner with Untangle Incorporated, but is not an agent of Untangle Incorporated. NextGen Appliances LLC is solely responsible for the content of this educational video. You can learn more about NextGen Appliances at our website, nextgenappliances.com.